What's up fellow content creators and streamers. Today, I'm gonna to show you guys how your chat can interact with your stream by using channel points. And they can do things such as put effects on your camera or make sound triggers, just fun little things they can do while you're streaming. It's really easy to set up and I'm gonna show you guys right now. But before we get into that, make sure you guys drop a like on this video, subscribe down below and turn on that little notification bell. But other than that, let's get right into the video. So the first step you guys are gonna to wanna to do is make sure that your OBS is up to date. All you guys are gonna to wanna to do is go to the help tab in OBS and then click on check for updates. And then as you guys can see, I have no updates available, so I'm good to go. Next up is go to this OBS WebSocket website. I'll have a link down in the description down below. And then all you're gonna wanna do is click on go to the download, scroll down to the bottom of this page and then click on whatever OS you're on. So for me, I'm on Windows. So I'm just gonna click this Windows installer. And then once you have that downloaded, you're just gonna wanna go through these steps. It's really easy to set up. Just click next um, and then install it. It's pretty easy to do. I already have it installed, so I don't really need to do that again and then the next step is to go to your twitch and go to your channel point rewards and then you're going to add whatever rewards you want so for me i have three different camera effects and then i also have 10 different sound effects all you do is just add a new custom reward name the reward whatever you want it as and then make sure you add a amount and then if you have any reward icon you can add here and then you can change the background color as well and then you're just going to click create and so now as you can see i have my test award and so now you're going to want to go to triggerfire.com. I will also have that link down in the description down below. And then you're just going to log in with Twitch. And now there's a bunch of different things you can have rewards for. You can have an image pop up on your screen. You can have a video. You can do sound effects. And then you can also do literally anything in OBS. So like different scenes. And so before you add anything to Triggerfire yet, we have to do a little bit more in OBS. So in your sources, you're just going to want to add a new browser. You can name it whatever you want. But for me, I name it triggers. And then you're going to want to go to trigger fire and click on this little link icon in the bottom right. And then you're just going to copy this link. And then with that link, you're just going to paste it in your browser. And then for the width and height, I would do the whole screen. So 1920 by 1080. And then you're going to want to check shut down sources when not visible and also refresh browser when scenes become active. And then you're just going to click OK. And so the next step is you go into trigger fire. And for this example, I'm going to add a new sound. So you just click this plus in the bottom right corner. You name the command name what you named it as the channel reward so for me it's test and then to make it a channel point reward you click on this little icon and then for the reward name you name it as the twitch channel point reward so once again for me it's test and then you just click save and then you're going to need to upload the sound that you want to get a lot of different fun sounds you just go to myinstance.com i'll also have that link down in the description and then pretty much it will have literally any sound that you want and so let's say for example i just want this crickets so you can click on the button and make sure that's what you want so if I stay like a stupid joke or something, someone could redeem that crickets and it would like kind of make it funny, you know what I mean? So you just click on the sound that you want and then you just download it as an MP3. And so now you can go back to trigger fire, select the file. And so now I have crickets uploaded and then all you're gonna wanna do is click the check. And so now your sound should be selected and then you just click save and now it's all good to go. So now once you go back to your OBS, you can make sure that it works. So I'm just gonna try out test. As you can see, it works completely fine. And then if it's a little too loud, you can go edit it and you can change the volume right here. And then if you guys wanna know how I add filters to my camera, just let me know down in the comments below. I'll make a separate video about that. It's pretty easy to set up. But other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you haven't already, please be sure to drop a like and subscribe and I'll be seeing you guys later. Peace out.